I'm Budi Sadikin, the Minister of Health of the Republic of Indonesia, delighted to appreciate 10 remarkable years of collaborations with the World Health Organization regional flagship programs. Indonesia has achieved significant milestone with the support of the WHO in several extensive areas. First, in infectious diseases, WHO provides incredible technical assistance in the effort to eliminate tuberculosis, measles, and rubella, addressing antimicrobial resistance and tackling neglected tropical diseases. This support is extended through the provision of epidemiological evidence, the formulation of national plans and guidelines, the enhancement of immunization, surveillance, the provision of essential diagnostic and medication, the expansion of testing and case finding, and the facilitation of cross-sectoral coordination. Moreover, in health emergencies program, from COVID-19 response, zoonosis prevention, to emergency preparedness, WHO has stood by our side, providing technical support for strengthening surveillance vaccines, therapeutics, and diagnostic, as well as with the financing mechanism. Second, in non-communicable diseases who plays a pivotal role in supporting Indonesian multifaceted initiative, which emphasize the prevention to control major NCDs through screening, advocacy, and policy development, tobacco control, expert technical guidance, and initiations of the Healthy Cities Program. Third, maternal and child mortality reductions also has made significant improvement in enhancing the coverage of key interventions and improving the quality of care. With support from the WHO, we have updated the national guidelines for childhood illness management, improved surveillance and response systems, reinforcing referral networks for emergency obstetric care and advancing contraceptive use through digital innovations. All in all, WHO has supported us in critical health system strengthening initiatives spanning across the six pillars of Indonesia's health transformation agenda from evidence generation, data analysis, and optimizing information systems to increasing the regulatory maturity of our technical agencies. I believe this effort will further improve the overall health and well-being of our people across Indonesia. Excellencies, I want to express my heartfelt gratitude to Dr. Poonam Singh, Regional Director of WHO Southeast Asia, for her leadership and unwavering support to all of us. Together we have achieved so much, and together we will continue to build a healthier and brighter future for Indonesia. Thank you. Thank you.